What's going on guys? Conic Fever here or you know, Kinetic Saint, whatever you want to call me. They all work. Um so guys, this is episode 2 of my live FFA with commentary and today we're going to be doing some studio and vertigo. We're going to hope to uh wreck it up and do as we usually do. So uh let's get this started, shall we? Alrighty, Hollywood, USA. They got some pretty cool sets in here, if I have to say. So, I'd have to say my favorite set is the old western with the saloon. I think that looks pretty baller. I'm just saying. I'm just, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna throw that out there. You know, looks looks pretty baller. You know. So, uh, yeah. Um, I've actually, I feel I've gotten my rhythm back with this TV and everything, this past few games, but, um, hoping for the best, I, uh, did a few practice rounds before I started, uh, recording for episode two, and, um, I feel this is gonna be a nice episode, I feel I can, uh, really, um, drop some damage, do well. Alright, um, so far I'm on a nice little streak. I don't know how far this is gonna go though. Oh, you're cool. You're cool. I'm gonna use my hunter kill on you. See what you do. See what you can do, son. What? Once again, just like in episode one, a bullet goes completely straight. But what happens? Oh, it's not on target. Yeah, that's not typical at all. Oh, it's spawn trap. Alright. Alrighty. Alright, let's do this. Warm it up. Claymore. You know, I actually probably should have saw that, but, um... Yeah, I didn't, so... I don't know what your problem is. But, uh... You wanna not be a OP tryhard? I'm just kidding. How can bots be OP? Yeah, they have their ways. Um, so, um, on a nice little streak over here by the saloon, hoping to uh, maybe get a nice kill streak going if um, our luck doesn't run out. <laughs> but uh, hopefully, I can go merciless or so, something decent, something that's content worthy of a local match. Because that's the hardest thing I probably have to do right now. Make this content enjoyable to watch and it's local. That's probably my hardest task as of now. And if you ask me, this is the most dominant spot in the map. If you are a sniper and you come here and you know how to handle yourself and defend the spawns, this is the best place to be in the entire map. You have a... Oh, wow. I mean, yeah, you have a great spawn trap position, and if you ask me, what free for all basically is, is learning your spawns, spawn trapping the enemy, and winning. That's basically exactly what free for all is. I mean, you can ask lots of other people. Even Phase Cross had a commentary on um, basically what free for all is and why people choose to play it. You know, I kind of choose to play it because. You know, I like the the team game modes like Demolition, Domination to hit my clips, but it's not the same as Free For All. Free For All, I feel I can be more consistent and a better player, unlike Demolition or something. Like, I can't quite see what the difference is, but I don't have to rely on a team. I can rely on myself, which I know I'm good enough. I can handle on my own by myself and do great. And... That's that's why I like free for all. I don't have to rely on anybody who's probably gonna cost me the game. And I just have to rely on myself and dominate the game. So that's basically what I wanna do. I wanna be the dominant player and if it means being someone everybody hates or everybody loves, you know, you gotta pay the price to be good at something. 
You can not everyone's gonna be a fan of you. Not everyone's gonna love you know being I just can't explain it, but you see what I'm getting at? What I'm trying to prove? What 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 I'm trying to summarize up technically, you can say that. Thirty and nine. That was pretty decent gameplay for uh local. You know, freaking local, I have to strain myself to be the freaking best in everything I do. And I guess to kind of switch it up a bit, we're going to throw some vertigo in here. See how this goes. Hopefully, it all ends well. I have a spot I like here at this map, but it can be a pain. You know, vertigo in that center building with all the freaking elevator doors and crap. It can actually... This can be an extremely deadly map if you don't know what you're doing. I mean, this can seriously not go your way. Like, I've seen it happen. I can totally see this not going somebody's way. And you end up getting raped, and it just doesn't end well for you. Which, you know, it's not going to end well for everybody. I mean, not everyone's going to have a happy ending when they play Free For All. Like I said in the first commentary, very unpredictable. And the spawns are extremely unpredictable. I've been spawned right on top of I don't know how many times. And it's BS when it happens. Wow, LMG at close range. You're cool. Okay. And then freaking riot shield. That also gets really annoying. If you ask me. Oh wow, there's a guy behind me. There's the unpredictable spawn again of vertigo free for all. Extremely unpredictable. Nice little headshot. Oh, you you want to camp up there with your LMG? No, you're gonna die. I do not think so, son. What? Oh, you you going around knifing people, huh? Go, going around knife? No, no. Hey, hey. Yeah, see, you got yourself down off that roof. Yeah, you can get your behind down, cause you ain't killing me up there again. Uh-uh, drop your shotgun, son. Drop your shotgun. You ain't, you ain't defeat me with no shotgun today. Not today. I can't be stopped. What? Yeah, it looks like I just ate my own words and jinxed, my, jinxed myself completely because here I am getting spawn trapped. Yeah, that's that's not shocking at all. Freaking hardened bots over here with their spawn trap. Yup. Of course. Th these spawns. So BS unpredictable. Like, it's retarded sometimes. Where they spawn. Like, it's unbelievable. Are you serious? Doing good so far. 16. Hopefully we can get some uh, bit better results here. This is the spot I was uh, talking about earlier. That's probably one of the greatest spots to spawn trap if you can pull it off. Because it can definitely, by far, not go in your favor. It's happened to me tons of times before. Especially with all the camping spots they have over here. Like, that. Like, that is overused with the freaking spots in there. It gets really annoying. And where are they spawning in? Like, what the frick? 
hey you want to spawn in like oh there he goes of course when I walk away and yep it's a trick I get gunned down on you are cool alright you are so awesome alright freaking bot making a comeback with this freaking BS yup wow you're, you're not OP you are not OP at all you're just a freaking amazing player alright what kind of action we got up in here Yep, that not being clat and the unpredictable elevator door, which is also overused in tons of situations. You over there still, Sunny Boy? Well, yeah, he's on the other side. Yeah, loving it. Oh yeah, look at that! Destroyed your C4, son. I don't know who you're trying to plant that on, but uh. Wasn't going in your favor. Let's see if I can dominate the square arena. Hit marker after hit marker. There we go. What? Yep. Come on. He's shooting at a guy over here. There he is. I'd say you're shooting at a guy. Where's he at? Hit marker. Yeah, you're done. <laughs> Eat that, son. Oh, oh man, I was hoping to get a clip in that kill cam. I thought I had it too. But you know, hit markers. Gotta love them. Tear your game apart. Well. Decent 30 and 12 It'll work It'll work You know whatever you got to do and for some reason I have a really f Weird feeling of playing another match But do I hmm Yeah, not really I Want to kind of keep it down low Freaking quicker I get this done the easier it'll render so um I might see you guys with another episode today. Not sure. You'll most likely see another one tomorrow morning. And then one in the evening and one maybe closer to 6 or 7 o'clock or so, possibly. But, um, hope you guys enjoyed episode 2. Um, there might be an episode 3. It's very unpredictable. If I do decide, I'll just upload it and you guys can enjoy an episode 3. But, um, that's about it. This is Conic Fever. Take care.